so often because of the resurrections are coming in. Some clever hiding here from Jay. Pulse Effect pop, wasn't pop. even checking. Yep, he could get the pulse. Oh, that stick on AKM. And now they can camp. The rest of the team go charging in. It looks like with that transcendence, the rest will happen for AKM. He's Another back into the life. fight. Another life. But hey, Chips and wrong place, wrong time. You're definitely dead. Both of them. The support's pinned against the wall. Yeah, I mean, it's just really good decision making. And also, it's, it seems right now that Jake's tracking has improved a little bit as well. But the decision to go for the Widow first is really smart because if you go for the Zen, he's just going to transcend out of it. And they're going to transcend soon after anyway. So you force them to resurrect that target and then you go in for the damage. Nice fight there based on that early initiation with the Pulse Bomb. Yeah, they know Jake isn't going to overextend. He knows that Effect was able to pick up the health pack. He'll be back up to full HP. Houston Outlaws will pick up the point. Working on pummeling that defense in the large pack. Get some little poke in. It looks like Houston's banking up ultimates. They want to go in full six, and they think that they have a more effective ultimate usage than the other team. Self-destruct goes in, and now they're going to fight on the point. Yeah, no, well, there's the second tick picked up for Houston Outlaws, and it will be the Primal Rage. They really are trying to do everything they can to force Chip's hand to use this trance to feel the pressure. And, well, as soon as Linkser goes for the blade, he gets tired of waiting. Chips pulls the trigger, but that's not stopping him. Three kills. Enormous. Enormous and through a lot of that transcendence to Chips will go down. And this initiation was so perfect for Houston. Very rarely do you want to open up fights with a self-destruct unless you just want to clear this. But it's looking like he'll be able to dash back to the heels. Not so sure about it for Linkser, though. He gets overwhelmed in the end. OG in effect working together. And Cool Matt denied the remake this time around. I don't even need this pulse bomb here either. There's just gonna be pure cleanup for Dallas. That is one of the best Dallas offensive pushes on Volskaya we have ever seen. Very nice play there. And now, do they have the chance to snowball this? I think they do. They did end up having Harry Hook with a very second take, but with his respawn advantage, there's almost no way it's going to happen. They're trying to buy some time. Chips even comes back as somber of all things just to get back into the fight. I mean, they got two tanks without any healers here. This is this is actually bonkers. Chips yeah. is back into this now. Harry Hook is here to heal. This is a winnable situation for Dallas as Linkster is just barely gonna hang on by a threat. Never Ooh. mind, deleted. OG goes primal as well, beats Bonnie to a bloody pulp, but they are gonna be able to pull this off unless Jake can get some magic going here. Overwhelmed and just a sliver left. A cool match back on the mix, and this is a transcend. However, they're stalling, but you have to get kills. A stall means nothing if you're not actually pushing them off of the point, and they have just been dying one by one on the point. The May is not going to be enough, and wow, Dallas, my apologies for calling that over. That Linkser, once again, the focus of effect. Effect going to force him back. Linkser now have, having to hold that closed OG angle. Has to, oh my god, but OG had to stay alive. He had 97%. He was so close to primal, but Matt snipes him down, and that might just be it. Both tanks out of this. Hang it in there, the fight. Overtime's gonna be burning, of course, but all the kills are here for Houston. It's Harry Hook. He's got the Valk, but not for long, and Effect will back off, just trying to stay alive a little bit longer, but he's not gonna be able to make it back to the point in time. Houston with a solid hold. He gets deleted by Linkster immediately. Already a man advantage here for the Houston Outlaws in this key fight. Chip Saiyan decides to get the trance out. Trying to top everybody up, and Linkser is dead. OG with the focus. Also cutting off the supports from the rest of this fight. Can they collapse onto these tanks touch the point. and punish them? Gotta touch the point just a little bit. Fact will end up falling here. Gotta make sure to keep some presence on the point, though. The last thing you want to do is give this up, and you have to be mindful. It's only 33%, but it does seem they're getting the kills they need. But Linkser and Jay combined for two. Oh, and it's not going to happen. So close. We will have the draw in the end. Two to two, the final score. Body shot can whittle down a little bit. Still trying to find a target as effect goes in and dies. There's a big opening. That's going to be a tough one to res for Harry Hook. Shot after shot. And so in my notes, I really only have for Houston, links are hard carry about this map because on this map that he's the he had just shows up and has huge games they rarely switch off of this on offense it's just going to be widow tracer as long as they can stand it until something has to give here a lot of time here making getting the max the wow. transcendence force well i don't know if they wanted to use that there nope primal denied moma survives doesn't go up at the bits akm however He's on it, he's got his infrasight, he knows where Linkser's playing from, looking for the headshot. Moma just goes, I mean, just goes right on through because he's busy stomping the supports into the ground. He's Moma with a 3k, gets his primal rage, gets out of it, gets a stop on the AKM at the end, and that will open up all this space. Point for the most part, AKM, a very capable McCree as well.
Jake gets a pulse bomb. This continues to push. They haven't fought a six in a little bit here. Has Dallas. They're going to try to buy some time. It's in the monster moments where Jake really just seems to stand out. There's Linkser with the headshot on Harry Hook. When you've got Linkser and Jake popping off, it's going to be so hard to hold here if you're Dallas Fuel. Houston Outlaws right now on the edge of picking up a third point on Blizzard World. Continuing with the presence on the payload and the body block on Mickey from Cool Mac. Denies him the contest and does secure the third point for Houston. He's going to be joining with effect. They're going to try to force a nod situation. Yeah, and Rockas had no idea there was going to be someone else there. And they're able to take down two. This res gets absolutely denied too. AKM doing work. Both supports down. What is this? What is going on? This is chaos. Dallas Fuel right now. Two big kills coming in from AKM. They get forced back. The dive pushes all the squish back into the arch. And it's perfectly done. Effect even here to make sure that nobody else can come through as they res up. And it's going to be a very quick A take coming in from Dallas Fuel. I'm just so glad that Sombra's finally in off. Does get hacked. That means he is just a floating trash can right now. Able to do nothing on that Devo. No abilities. Cool Matt will die. Someone killed Cool Matt. That's big. Cool Matt is dead. Yes, there you go. You are welcome. OGE, primal hunting for targets. Rock is right on the edge. Gets overwhelmed. Mooma not able to make it back in time. And in time, in time, Effect is just on the payload, pushing it forward. Oh, look, it's such style points. Uh, Jake has got to be in trouble. He's, get, he's out of abilities, and AKM hunts him down. Beautiful play, and that will top it off. So EMP available now. Rockus might try to get an EMP out or uh, transcend out. Yeah, he saved it right around the corner to keep his team alive. Nice play from Rockus. Yeah, perfect, perfect. He's so hard to get that EMP to connect with. Oh, that's going to prompt Momento to go charging in. But hey, gets melted immediately. Again, those Discord orbs on point. Links are headshot by Chips. Chips with the big plays right now. Making the difference for Dallas Fuel. The self-destruct guaranteeing the follow-up on Cool Matt. That's a great play from Chips right there. That was during a Deadeye, and time has been canceled by the Omnic himself. They will still continue to walk this in. Muma will stall just for a moment. They will push this off the cart, and wow, what a time for Dallas. They were winning the fight. That's not gonna happen. We already have the back exactly effect. Looking for that flank, looking for that hamstring. Not quite gonna find it though, and Banny dropping dangerously low. Mickey with the all-out aggression, takes the fight to oh, oh, kills for Mickey. Let's go, self-destruct just to get a new mech because he knows there's only 10 seconds left on this clock. Hey, self-destruct to just finish off Rockets with a blaster for style points right there. Now he's out of mech, it's a little bit rough though. Matt's gonna come in, touch the point, keep it alive for his team. They gotta start getting kills. Matt very low, Matt out of mech. Uh, he's not gonna be long for this world. He is dead, Mickey finds that kill, AKM just to make sure. Really throwing it in there, the EMP denying the res from Bani, and this is gonna be the hold for the Dallas Fuel. Mumma not able to get back in time. Yeah, it's gonna come up over top, try to rain some rockets. I'm still looking at effect though. Effect could crack this open. Huge kill from AKM. That's it. AKM finds the kill onto Linkser. Bonnie will be able to get the res off, it looks like. No problem there. Jake, the tire gone. And already the fight continuing as the self-destruct gets thrown in by Mickey. Not gonna find any kills. Cool mats, neither. And while they are pressing forward here, Dallas, five alive on this point versus the four for Houston Outlaws. And well, Rockus is the only form of healing that the Outlaws have. Outlaws need to find some kills, and they're doing just that. Cool Matt runs over Chips. OG goes down. This is getting out of hand. It's the resin of Chips when Harry Hill gives his life for it. They've been very low on the point right now. This one is a brawl. The next couple kills could decide things. Mickey's going to get out of mech. d max deleted. Whew. Unbelievable. Active now. It's going to be the all-out brawl here on the point. See? Oh! Get out! Boink denying him. OGE goes over the edge. He got the Lucio too, but there's Harry Hook. He skated his way back into life. Fight hands down, good and clean. And there's Clockwork trying to go for it, but he gets denied by Chip Saiyan. Yeah, it was a really nice position to try that barrage though, because when he does get killed, he falls down on the ledge and they're able to resurrect him. He's back into the mix and takes down Mickey. Harry Hook now back into this mix too. Desperation for Dallas. You have to res Harry in that situation because he has barrier. Yeah, you need to get that. That's gonna win him a fight. Here. Yeah, it does look like it is gonna turn it around for him. Muma and Links are the last two alive here for Houston Outlaws, but not for long. And at 97%, an OGE find that high value target. Doesn't quite look like Chipshead's gonna be able to get in position to get that kill either, to get that res off rather. Uh, Chips had a Valkyrie up as well, but it doesn't matter. He's keeping everyone healthy. He's gonna res up OGE instead. They have more bodies on the point, does Dallas. Mickey's gonna go grab himself up back, and I think Dallas is gonna take the stage, Semler. It's looking good, Muma. Not gonna make it in time. Denied, and well, Cool Matt, body blocked off. Perfectly done there. Or on the Farah, and nice. there's the snag. Perfectly done. Patience 
He's rewarded for it, Linkser, and AKM dangerously low as well. Somehow, we are able to get the res on from Chip Saiyan, but he's not able to make it up in time to keep AKM alive. Yeah, it's just not going to be enough. They had already lost effect as well, so it's a Sophie's choice. Which one do you bring back to life? He's gonna offer his support partner a nice barrage there, cleans it up, a nice concussion there, and clockwork. Looking for the follow-up, you gotta go for the reload! Clockwork even trying to get in on it, or Cool Matt, rather. Yeah, you gotta hit two in a row, though, when you got the pocket, and there it is! There's a finish on the AKM, Clockwork! Whew. So sick. Finds Whoa. chips, Effect is alive. Effect could try and tap the point, but no, he's denied by Linkser, and OG can't make it back in time. So, it is gonna be Clockwork. Ow, that's a big spot on Effect, forces the recall. There's the Pulse, not gonna connect. Chip Saiyan finds Cool Matt though, and OG hanging on by a thread. Certainly not gonna be for long, Clockwork finds him. Yeah, but the rest of the kills are going Dallas's way right now. Linkser also takes a shot. Clockwork trying to bring this back on his own. Clockwork just knocked down three. Clockwork, a one-man Wrecking Crew is going to stay alive as well, and at the very least, he's going to be alive on the point. A cleanup there from Rockus, and they're unable to pull this back. We continue going. They could even try and get in here. Cool Matt, is he going to make it in time? Cool yeah. Matt, he's going to be able to just contest it. Sliver left here, and he's getting pocketed by both healers as well. They're just going to throw the trance in here. Rockus deciding it's all or nothing now. We will not let Dallas take control of this point. We will, well, I mean, take over. Look at this. They're getting forced back. Dallas, it looked like they had everything in hand. Killed before he can get trance into play. That is going to be the res coming in from Harry Hook. Linkster is gone. OG is there, but Clockwork right now is on a tear. The Pulse Bomb is in, but it misses the target. And now he just needs to stay alive. He's dropped low. That Pulse Bomb is meant to kill Baby Diva at the moment. She's ejecting, but the timing was just a little bit off. Transcendence on point to try to keep Dallas into this. Cool Matt is going to take down his counterpart. They don't really have the numbers. It is a 4v3 scrap. Chips comes alive, though. Yeah, and the Rockus trance is into it now as well. And so they are not going to die anytime soon here. Houston, Cool Matt even taking the fight straight to AKM. This time, AKM will not survive. And it's overtime now. Nobody there to touch the point for Dallas and the Houston Outlaws will win this series. Oh, guys, you know, uh, uh, you, you get on it. Linkser continues to dominate. AKM goes down. Harry Hook will bring him back to life. Jake's able to take down effect. The DPS for Houston Outlaws outperforming their counterparts on the other side. This is where Dallas has to dig deep and just find something to play for. Of course, the series is over. The set is over. But you got to have to play for pride at some point, and they were getting absolutely obliterated 10 to 1 here on Route 66 as far as kills go. Yeah, they're just not finding any kills. Rez in your face. Rock is brought back. I like it. Good pack control there from Effect. Might have to get used on the recall, though. Yep, sure enough. Recall is out, and there it is. Jake is there to pounce. Pack might be coming off a cooldown here as this fight continues. Effect waiting for it, desperate, just trying to hang in there, but... They continue to struggle. They cannot win duels right now. Oh, getting 21, absolutely crushed again. 22 kills for Houston Outlaws, one kill for Dallas. And it's hard to read the minds of pro players, but you have to imagine it's difficult to really get up for this now after you probably should have won Blizzard World. That Elios was a little bit closer, but not quite the same. And it's left. Houston has to get on the card if they want to try to finish out Route 66. Rock is dying. Isn't going to help things, though. Will Bonnie be able to get the res off? No, and Bonnie dies with the Valk as well. That pretty much stuffs it here for the Houston Outlaws as the over overtime wick is burning. <laughs> Links are just deciding, hey, I'm going to make this personal. I'm going to take the fight straight to you, AKM. AKM with the parting shot. However, he gets the last word. That's always a feel-good moment. Well, it is going to be just cool, man. Everybody's staggering it out here for Houston Outlaws as Banny is going to pop wings just to fly back. <laughs> Tough Get target to kill. Are they fine? They don't even manage to get the last kill on AKM. Yeah. That would have been... Oh, that was so close. Jake kills himself as well. That's not going to help things here for the Houston Outlaws. <laughs> you, you think? Uh, yeah, usually nine times out of ten, death isn't real. It doesn't really help. All right, Linkser, let's go. Effect will manage to pick up one. Cool Matt will get his rematch going, however, and they are forced to give ground. This is a successful fight for Houston Outlaws. They bided their time. They were patient nicely here. His effect is only just now going to be able to get back into this fight. He's running back in. Harry Hook has got the wings out, but Chip Saiyan dies regardless. Yeah, Paul's problem one in there put Chips into a bad situation, and then they were able to clean him up. The tr transcend comes out from Rockus, perhaps lighting that victory candle of a transcendence. Looking for a little bit more. OG is going to jump in, wants to go after the Widow, and realizes he's got to touch the card. I mean, you got Bonnie just healing right now, but yeah, you now that you have Cool Matt back, it is going to be a quick death there for OGE. All the chain heals going through. Cool Matt even going for the self-destruct over. And a hard defeat here for the Dallas Fuel. Houston Outlaws, they reign supreme in Texas. Truly the coup de grace from Houston there. The mercy kill at the end as Dallas didn't seem to have their whole heart. In Check out our website at actionesports.com to stay up to date on the latest matches, 
highlights, and more from scores, match history, and specific game info, we've got you covered for all things Overwatch Esports. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to check out our channel for more action-packed content. Also, like and share this video, and click the subscribe button to join our notification squad. Thanks for watching.